Thank you for checking out this tutorial for Switcher Studio Pro. Today, I'm going to show you how to remotely control the pan and tilt of an auxiliary camera using the Motor Galileo. The Galileo is a robotic dock for iPhone and iPod Touch that acts as a remote camera operator for your productions. The Galileo comes in both 30-pin and Bluetooth versions. You can save 10% on your purchase of the Galileo and other accessories from Motor by using the promo code SWITCHER at checkout. Let's start by making sure all of my devices are on the same Wi-Fi network. In this tutorial, I'll be using the Bluetooth version of the Galileo. In that case, I will also enable Bluetooth in my phone settings. You could also do this from the Control Center menu by swiping up from the bottom of your phone screen. Now, on the device you're going to connect to the Galileo, go into your settings. Scroll down to the Switcher app icon and tap it to open the app settings. Find Galileo in this menu and enable Auto Detection. If you also enable Check for Updates, your device will search for firmware updates each time you connect your Galileo. If you are using Motor's iPhone 5 or iPhone 6 adapter, you should also take this opportunity to change your device orientation to Inverted. This is under the Switcher Settings section. This will ensure that your video will display correctly when running your production. Next, open Switcher Studio on the iPhone that you will be connecting to the Galileo dock. Select Uses Camera from the splash screen menu. Now you can mount your iPhone or iPod Touch into the Galileo. Carefully rotate the upper tier into position so that both pan and tilt can be controlled. Twist the bottom of the Galileo to turn it on. A message will appear on your phone telling you that Galileo would like to connect. Simply tap connect. Next, open Switcher Studio on your main switching device. I'm using an iPad mini. Remember, all devices in your setup need to be on the same Wi-Fi network. In the Inputs tab, select your iPhone to establish the connection. Accept the invitation on the phone if necessary. On the iPad, in the bottom left panel, tap the camera square corresponding to your iPhone. The video coming from the iPhone's camera will appear in the preview pane in the top left. A white label with the text Galileo will also appear at the bottom of this preview window. Now, you can simply touch and drag the video in the preview pane to remotely control the Galileo. Using the preview pane, you can position your camera to the correct orientation before transitioning to it. However, you could also take the source live and still remotely control the position of the active camera from the preview pane. So, now you know how to pair your phone with the Motor Galileo and use it in a multi-camera production. You can connect up to three Galileos to remotely control unmanned cameras. Thank you for watching this tutorial for Switcher Studio Pro. Please subscribe to our newsletter to stay up to date on the newest features and updates from Switcher Studio. Finally, check out these other tutorials to get more familiar with Switcher and start making live video like a pro.